So tell me about this tray. Did you make it too? That tray? Oh, well, that's lacquered for a tray from Japan. That's no. beautiful. No, but wow, these are beautiful. These tell me, what are they? These are three-dimensional capes woven to be worn. Wow. Worn and danced in or whatever, whatever, whatever. Ah, and, and are they, did you make them up or are they a copy of some... Thing? I was making, things happen, you know, I was making a necklace and all of a sudden the necklace converted into something else. <laughs> I love it, was, it. You know, the material just was there and I said, well, and this is it, this is it. So I'm airing them out, otherwise I die. They're beautiful. These are tapes. And I, I did this because I got these sacred feathers from a friend. From a live bird. You know, this live bird here. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this skins. Uh, How beautiful. They're really exotic. I say, oh yeah. my gosh, I can't let this bird. They look kind of like um, South American or African yes, yes. dancing costumes. Yes, buttons and... They're beautiful. Honor these beautiful... Look at this skin. Look at this bird. Yes. What kind of bird do you know? No. But just it was a beautiful bird. Just a bird that had been died. Just, you know. <laughs> uh, I said no. I gotta use you otherwise. Not for my baskets, but for. And these are pieces of leather. Yes, I had a and suit. string. I, had, I went to Hong Kong. You know, everybody goes to Hong Kong if you're in Japan. Yeah. And then you get this tailor-made suit, a leather tailor-made suit. Ah. And I said, I think I'll. Cut it up and put it in my work. How beautiful. That's resourcefulness. You know, it you is. To use things that are like leather is an animal product. You know, it's like this animal was this thing was an animal a skin. Yeah. <laughs> and this this is macrame macrame or weaving or knot work, isn't it? It's netting, like netting like a netting. Very beautiful. And I love your uh, your deck and your uh, your netting netting handrail. Well, I have to air it up because there was a cockroach right uh, on the side and a big one. You know? So can you put one on for me? No. Do you have one you like the best? Mm. That would be hard. I like them all. Mm. I see, I started a necklace and all of a sudden it got like out of control. It started out as a necklace. I love that. Yeah, then it got out of control. It did. It grew and expanded. <laughs> oh, I mean, it, uh, it won't stop. Show me the part that was a necklace. That's funny. This part. Uh, this part. The buttons. How do I utilize these buttons? Yes. So I can make the most of them. It's so beautiful. Let me see if I can wear this. Might not go. Yeah, it might go with what I'm wearing. It might. Okay. Oh. How fun! <laughs> That's so beautiful and fun. And and what does it have a name? Well, these caves used to be used for rituals and dances. And yes. And, and yes. People used to dress up, you know, with fiber outfits. Wow. I, I dreamed that I had been a maker of these capes, and I started making a cape. I said, "Well, it might not be used today." Then but again, it really might. It is a, a work of art. It this certainly is. is it's beautiful. How and cool. And it could even be a skirt if you want. I'm thinking it could be a skirt. Oh, well, I, I had a couple of people buy my capes from the shop, Paradise uh -huh. Gift Shop. Okay. And then, you know, these are feathers. You know, these are mm -hmm. these beautiful peacock feathers. They are beautiful. But. All the things that came to me, I, I try and utilize, and mm -hmm. and that's what art is about. You have to put it into your 
Integrate it. Integrate yes. it. Yes. Yeah. Well, I liberated my tapes. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, look, is that nice? I want you to look at it. I think you'll yeah. find it interesting. It's fascinating how many knots I there know. are. I know. Just if you're a mariner. Yes. Mariners are.